You'll be pretty safe watching those fireworks atop a mountain, but it is important to note firework injuries skyrocketed last year. The majority of those injuries, of course, taking place in the time surrounding the 4th of July. This accident was in Simi Valley, California last year. Fireworks shot out into the crowd instead of up into the air. More than two dozen people were treated for injuries. Not in your side, Simone Del Rosario joins us with some staggering statistics to share. Guys, Stella, fireworks can be a ton of fun just as long as you're safe about it. The U.S. Consumer uh, safety Commission just released the numbers. Last year, eight people died being too reckless around fireworks, and more than 11,000 others were injured, up 30% from the year before. Sometimes people walk away laughing. Sometimes they don't walk away at all. In this Virginia Beach house fire last summer, two people died when a man's cigarette ignited fireworks inside the home. Did your mom talk to you guys before you do fireworks about like how to be safe with them? You have to be safe. You have to listen to the adults. And if there's an emergency, who do you call? 911. Suzanne Martinez says safety is a top priority when deciding what fireworks to buy and how to celebrate the holiday with her family. My dad will probably be the one to light the fuse and the kids will just stand back and watch them. Yeah, I don't, I'm not into letting them run around with them. The sparklers, that's a little bit different. I played with sparklers when I was a kid, grew up in Colorado, so the sparklers I'll let them run around with. <laughs> she may be surprised to find out sparklers account for 31% of firework related injuries last year. Because of that, Tucson Fire says the longer the stem, the better. And the firework salesman also has a tip for parents to keep their kids safe. If it goes up higher in a foot in the air of a fountain, then usually you tell them that's, that might be a little bit too dangerous for them. They still could get burnt one way or another. At the same time, speaking from his own experience, he says boys will be boys, whether they're kids or that of a wiser generation. Well, no matter what you're doing tonight, remember to be safe and take extra precautions. Read the labels before you light, and if the firework seems to be a dud, don't relight, just move on. So happy 4th, everyone.